Hi everyone, so I wanted to do a quick review for you. Um, I have the Smashbox, what is it, Softbox Eye Palette. Looks like this. I've actually taken it out of the box. I bought it about three weeks ago and have been using it and tried it and tested it and I'm going to uh, give you my opinion. So this is what all the colors look like inside. Comes with a little brush. I tend to just throw these little brushes away because I have my own that I love. Um, but you can see you have different looks here. So you have more of a bronzy look, more of a matte brown look, and then more of a matte gray look. Um, so I'll show you the colors that I love. Oh, sorry. And then on the side you have gel liners on either side to go with either look. So um, overall I think it's a great value for your money. Not 100% sure what I paid. I think I had a coupon at Ulta, so that's why I bought it. Um, but I think overall it's a great value for your money if you're just starting out um, and don't have a whole lot of eyeshadow colors. I think it's a great value. I think you get a lot of colors for um, what you pay for. I think the pigmentation is great on all of them. Um, I really like these sides here for like a, like a natural smoky eye, maybe for a wedding or for a graduation, things like that. I really love this side here. Um, and it actually tells you how to do it. So you use the top one for all over the lid, this one for the crease, and then this one for blending. I believe that's how you do it. <laughs> I didn't read the instructions. That's how I did it. Um, now again, the middle one is great for summer. Uh, you have like a lighter white color, a pink, and then like a muddy brown color, which is great for summer, going to the beach, things like that. And then this one is great bronzy colors. Um, I absolutely love these. You have like a champagne color, a bronze color, and then a little bit darker bronze. Um, or like a brownie bronze. I love those. Uh, great for fall, great for summer, depending on the look that you're going for. So I also like the gels, the gel eyeliners. They're not as pigmented as I would like. Um, but I guess I'm used to the MAC Fluid line and the Makeup Forever eyeliners. So I think they're not as pigmented as I would like them. But for overall, if you're just starting out with makeup... I think it's a great value. I think that you get a lot of product for your money. Um, I can say that the only downside to them is that they do have a lot of fallout. So you will get a ton of fallout, which to me is kind of a pain because you need to put a tissue and then wipe it off or retouch it in your makeup. So for me, that's not very practical, but I think that, um, you know, for the value that you get, I think it's great. Uh, so again, I would I would definitely recommend it. I really like the, the product. Um, again, this is the box that it came in. These are the actual colors. I didn't personally use the brush because I don't, I don't need any extra brushes, so I just left it in there. Um, so I don't know if the brush is a good quality. I, I have no idea. Um, so yeah, again, I would, I would definitely recommend it if you're just starting out, need extra colors in your, uh, collection. Um, great colors, great for every day, great for weddings, great for night. You can mix it up and things like that, so... Um, overall, yeah, I think it's a great value for your money. Definitely check it out. I know that they carry it at Ulta, and I'm sure on Smashbox.com, too. So, all right, guys. Hope that helps. Bye-bye.